And welcome back. Three teams came into tonight with the top win streaks in the SWAC. And two of those teams are at JSU, the women's basketball team. They've won five straight, the men's team three straight, and they were both at home tonight. Let's go to the AAC where Tamika Reese Tigers hosting UAPB is a part of the doubleheader. Don Brown, the former JSU Tiger, back at home with her Golden Lions. But Antoinette Womack out of Jim Hill High School looking like Amisha Williams there with the put back plus the foul. She had nine points tonight. Then off of the steal, JSU had a lot of those. Jasia Rogan, who had a game high 19 points, was in a giving mood as she finds Jaria Covington for three. She hits it. Just to let you know how dominant the Tigers were, they led UAPB by 48 points. It's also the fifth time they've held a SWAC opponent under 50 points this year. JSU cruises to their sixth straight win, 81 48 the final. Here's the head coach on that defense. I'm extremely proud of where we are defensively. Uh, you know, we have two players guarding the ball and they scrambled out of the situation to match up. Um, you know, we're playing extremely heady. We're playing smart defensively. We have some small things that we have to correct. Uh, but right now, I really like where we are defensively. And JSU's next game is at rival Alcorn State on Saturday. And JSU head football coach, Coach Prime, Deion Sanders, and JSU's AD Ashley Robinson, they were in the house watching tonight's doubleheader. If you remember, Snacks hit the SB winning shot against UAPB the last time they met. Will the teams meet again? Tristan Jarrett starts us off with a tough turnaround and hits off the glass. He had a game high 31 points. JSU up 9 to 2 to start. The Golden Lions answer, though, with the alley oop to Daquan Morris in transition. So Wayne Brent gets his team together, coaches them up, and they respond. Isaiah Williams scoring from the baseline. And he had 12 points. It was back and forth, but JSU got the lead at half, and they held off the Golden Lions down the stretch. Coach Brent's Tigers improved to 4-0 on the swag as they win 63-55.